famous code Bollywood, right? So everyone had to come up somehow in Bollywood dress. And there were 80 year old grannies from the UK who had to ask their Asian neighbours how to put a sari on. And it was, it was, it was, it was a great, great event. We got editorial in the newspaper. And the editorial said this, church brings races together. Isn't that nice? Everyone's welcome to this Bollywood event. 250 people signed up for this Bollywood event. Our church only had 50 people in it, right? So this was like way out of our comfort zone. On the night, the Asian Elvis impersonator turns up in a Mercedes with a driver. And, and I go, oh, nice to see you. And he wouldn't shake my hand because he's a celebrity and I'm not, right? He actually was terrible. He was the worst Elvis impersonator in the world. <laughs> but luckily I also booked the local Bollywood dance group, which was a bunch of teenagers that learned how to do Bollywood dancing. And then we showed them a little clip from a, a few Bollywood movies and I gave a gospel talk about the, the power of uh, reconciliation. Anyway, so, so basically I would say try stuff. Be uh, creative, give it a go. If no one had come to my event, I still would have counted it a win that we tried. Because in the newspaper it said, church brings races together before the event had taken place, right? So even the advertising was doing something prophetic about the gospel.